So if I was to give you some free advice, I would probably say bread, escalators, sleep. Not at the same time. Bread, something you've been told you can't have. Actually, in the scientific data, people that kept bread in their diet were more likely to stick to it. And there's still no evidence this day to suggest that low carbohydrate diets are better to any other diet when calories are, are matched. So if you're a carb lover like me, we, we don't need to give them up. Next time we want to lose a bit of fat. Escalators. Another thing a lot of people aren't really told about is we burn way more calories outside the gym than we do in the gym. And when we do start dieting, people are often more likely to stand still in an escalator. Remaining accountable to the amount of steps you do, paired with the amount of calories you're having, means that you don't need to beat yourself up if you miss the gym. Just make sure that you're not standing still in escalators. You're walking to the car parking space that's further from the shop entrance and you can have a positive effect on the amount of calories you burn creating better results for fat loss and sleep a lot of people don't understand that sleep is a very important part of dieting lifestyle well-being and even how much muscle we have in not a diet book i talk about these and many other things that you may not know about in quite a lot of detail all with the objective of making your life easier when it comes to fat loss getting in shape and staying in good shape you can order Not A Diet Book right now and throughout the whole book and the rest of your life, you'll never need to give up bread. It's a pretty good deal.